So this is an interesting fun fact. At Perth, in the race on the Sunday, we pulled two and a half kilos of used rubber out of the car. Now, it ends up in the weirdest places, like the sills fill up through there, the rear bumper ends up with about this much all the way along, and this is what it looks like. That's what two, two and a half kilos of rubber looks like. As you can see, it's, um, it sticks together pretty good, and, uh, um, but it ends up everywhere. And the softer the tire, the, um, the more rubber that comes off. So we have a couple of things on the car. This sits in front of the, um, the muffler and catches the rubber because what was happening was the rubber was getting around the, the muffler and it was catching on fire. So we end up with this in there to stop all the, the rubber getting onto the muffler. And another interesting thing is with the soft tire rubber or, or the super soft tire rubber, when you're cleaning the cars down, it's a lot harder to get off the car. It smears really easy. So it's much stickier. So if you come closer, Rachel, and you have a look at the rubber, this is off the car really from, um, from Bathurst. So that was the hard tire rubber. And you can see how it's, you know, it's sort of sticky together, but it, not that much. If you look at this one, this is the, the soft tire rubber from Perth. And you can see it's, it's actually got a very different look about it. But even now, it's still sticky and flexible where this isn't. So it, it does make a bit of a difference. The softer the tire, the more rubber we get. But um, um, Thomas collects his, this stuff for me and uh, leaves it in a neat little bag in my office. So um, whenever we see something that creates a good story, the boys are onto it here at BJR.